Hello everybody, it's Charlotte here, or Mama Char. Welcome back to a brand new video on this channel. In today's video, we're going to be going over my 20 months on hormones. I've been 20 months on hormones for, with spinal lactone and estrogen. I've been like, I think four months on progesterone. How are you guys doing today? But today, um, I want to show you guys everything that I've gone through since the beginning of my transition till now. I think there's a, I think at this point in my time being, I said I wasn't going to do any more update videos. But I kind of do want to continue to like let you guys in on this stuff because it's just my life, you know? It's just the way I want to present myself on my YouTube channel is always giving you guys information about stuff in my journey. Let's get into it. So, um, lately I have been actually getting a lot more dysphoria around this area of my body. And it's very hard to cope with because at first I thought these were good size and now I'm like, these are like the smallest tits you'll ever see on anybody. <laughs> it's crazy. Um, fat, re fat redistribution has been very good. It has, I have been getting curves a lot easier. My butt isn't growing. Um, I think I'm almost nearly at an hourglass. And what I mean by hourglass means top measures the same as the bottom. And of course with the same, with the smaller, smaller, smaller uh, waist. Hips need to be exactly the same size as the shoulders. Body hair obviously doesn't grow back. In fact, I've actually been noticing that body hair hasn't really grown back really much quickly. Real, like I can go like four or five days without shaving on my legs and I still won't have any problems with hair. Which is actually surprising because at first it was like every other day I'd still have to like shave. Whereas now it's not that, not the case. My skin obviously is softer. It's always been softer. By the way guys, I got my nails done. Check that out. Amazing job done. Mood swings kind of came back, but now they're going away again. And I'm finally kind of settling down of what, what, like my, you know, what mood I'm usually at. Like I can control my, my feelings now. It's a lot better and it's a lot easier than it was before. Obviously you don't get bone change, uh, change in bone. So like everything when it comes to bone structure is still the same, unfortunately. Um, but it's okay at this point. I think I'm just aiming for surgeries. I also want to tell you guys right now, now that we're talking about it, is that I actually have a GoFundMe that I just updated. And this is for my uh, SRS or FFS. We're going to be, uh, I'm, I want to be saving money up both on both of those ends uh, to go towards those surgeries. So if you guys do want to support, you guys do want to be a part of that, go, uh, go donate to my um, GoFundMe in the description. If not, you don't have to. Even if it's a dollar, you guys can support with a dollar. It means a lot and it would mean a lot if we can continue to grow as a YouTube channel and help other transgender people. In the end, that's what I'm trying to go for. That's my goals. At the same time, I have my own journey. So I want to live that journey and I want to be able to be successful in it. Um, I've been talking to a lot of people to the side on transgender issues and trying to get them to understand. Especially because... Yo Girl has a 116,000 viewed video on this channel and I and I do get a lot of people that are very skeptical and people that always have something to say so I always right now I'm talking to some people and helping them understand what transgender is only transgender people know what transgender is on to the physical changes That's been my changes uh, from right there. And then right here, of course, decent. They're, they actually haven't been growing as much. I thought that they would because I'm a progesterone, but right now, as we know, we, we do know that um, it's just an experiment at this point in, in transition. So maybe, maybe, I might, maybe I might be wrong. Maybe I need to take progesterone for a while. Um, but so far, I haven't really seen any significant change other than fat redistribution that has been, gotten better when I've been on, as I've been on progesterone. Sex drive is always been mellowed out. In fact, right now at this point, it doesn't go down or up. It's actually pretty decently towards average. Um, I do get sex drives. I do, um, I still do. Uh, it's, this is actually kind of nervous to say. I still climax and I st it still feels good. So yeah, nothing big problem in there. I still, I, I still have a good sex drive. I could control it. Um, I already told you guys plenty of times. 
I don't ever have any randoms, and that's a good thing because I would hate to have randoms trying to present myself as female. Honestly, don't know what uh, changes I had so far other than that. But I, I'm gonna let you guys know that a lot of the things haven't actually mellowed out, unless I'm not noticing them at this point, and they're actually there or they haven't come yet. I really haven't noticed anything, but everything's kind of mellowed out um, at this point. Um, in fact, I will probably leave this off. This will probably be the last update video for another four months until I hit my two years on hormones. And that's when I'll give you guys the next update. But right now, this is going to be the only update for this amount of, uh, this far in my transition when it comes to hormonal uh, changes. When you, when you take hormones, it is a big change, but it's not a big change. It's a weird thing to say, um, don't expect the most amazing results all the time as your body interacts differently with hormones. Everybody's body does. And I can't tell you guys, my results aren't going to be your guys's and our timelines aren't exactly the same as everybody else's. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the video, got some information, uh, and it was just more for uh, just giving you guys a little update and showing you guys that I do have a GoFundMe out. So yeah, if you guys do want to subscribe, subscribe down below, press the notification box as well. So you guys get notified every time I upload a video to YouTube. And if you guys want to uh, follow my social media links as well, donate to my don GoFundMe or donate or, or buy my book online. I'm Mama Shara. You guys are my Charlotte Tears. I love you guys. Lots of tater tots. And I'll see you guys next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.